is here. It is time for the great one to do another try not to laugh challenge. This time, we're going to do it to them boys RDC World 1 Suburb Olympics. Can RDC World 1 break the great one? It's inward. He's definitely not going to be taking home the gold with that one. He's going to have to rethink his strategy next time. Canada is definitely not happy with this one. Highly, J Rock, hands come back to you too. What is happening in 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 with the mill youngs and millions of J Rock fans from all over the world? Baby J Rock is here. We're about to check out this RDC World One Suburb Olympics. J-Rock decided, why not make this a try not to laugh? These brothers are hilarious, so we'll see if they're able to break the YouTube people's channel, all right? Um, make sure that you hit that subscribe button, all right? Road to 2,000 subs uh, is underway. We are almost there. Hit that like button for me as well. Uh, appreciate any support you drop on this video, but we're not going to waste some more time. So J-Rock says this, RDC World 1, just bring. And welcome to our first annual Suburb Olympics. Here are some of our contestants ready to get this one started. We are excited to be here and see who will be able to achieve a gold medal in this Olympics. Starting off with N-word restraint, we have Leela Menigo from the Canadian suburbs. One of the top suburbs looking to get the gold today. I'm looking forward to how he handles this one. <coughs> May I help you? Um, yeah, I'm just looking for my, uh, you know, my box. But I think that is mine right here. They delivered to the wrong address. Take it up with USPS. Get off my property. Nah, I'm saying that that's literally my boss said my name. Yeah, and right. you're trespassing. Get off my property. Take it up with USPS like I said. Bro, it's literally not that serious. Let me just get the box, bro. No. Man. Bro, you doing What's with it with you people? Ooh, oh, and I'm not sure about that There's one. There's just no talking to you. To, to what? It's no talking to what? And here it is, the big moment. Urban people. Oh, okay. Man, I'm about to go. Hey! No, no, watch out, watch out, watch out, bro. And there it is, the famous N-word. He's definitely not going to be taking home the gold with that one. He's going to have to rethink his strategy next time. Canada is definitely not happy with this one, considering they were considered a favorite in this round. Next up, we have Desmond Johnson from USA Suburbs. Now, we know that the USA Suburbs is some of the most racist suburbs across the world. Will he be able to take home the gold in N-word restraint? He does not look like a strong candidate. No, no, you get your goddamn out here. And there it is, not even five seconds. The Americans are ruthless as usual. Racism is running amok out there. They definitely are going to have to find a better way to hold that racism in. It is getting blatant. Right off the bat, Desmond Johnson is eliminated. But I can't say we expected much from him. And now we have Mark Phillips from the Sweden suburbs. Not too many people know a lot about the Swedish suburbs. They are a sleeper, but we're going to find out today how good they yeah, are at killing me from with racism. This right now. What are you doing? Oh, what's up? Mm -hmm. uh, it seems like the mailman uh, mm -hmm. brought my package on action. You know, okay, I live okay. next door. Well, you're trespassing, and I don't know if you know, but that is a federal crime. I just want you to know that. I understand that, and I apologize. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to get my package, mm -hmm. and I'm going to be gone. Um, no, I'll return that to sender, and you can get it from USPS uh, next time. So why, just why would I let you return it? Get off of my right property here. right now. I'm, not, I'm telling I'm not you really No, you are going to do all that. I'm going to let you know right Demetrius, listen. Nigga, my name ain't fucking Demetrius. What are you talking about? He's looking like he can fold right here. I thought I thought it was Demetrius. Why would you think my name was Demetrius? Whole time, I, I, I you know, Man, you I, whoa, 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 hey, 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 look, I just wanna let this show. I wanna let so you know. you gonna call the cops? No, they're already called, buddy. I was just gonna call them again. No, a twist, he sticks the landing. I called before I opened the door. But uh, I just wanna let you know, I am the neighborhood watch captain because I don't think you know who I am. Man, you want some bullshit, bro. I'm finna go. Bro. Oh, okay, okay. No, just go ahead. Carry on. I will, nigga. What you doing? Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. And this is gonna be the point right here, and. Okay. Amazing. Truly a stellar performance from Mark Phillips. Nothing less expected from the Swedish people. We don't hear too much about racism in that country. And they are proving it here today. Mark Phillips has our first gold in the Suburb Olympics. Let's get to the next round. 
And with this event, we have racist dressing. And we love it. They are giving it their all right off the back, starting with Lila Menigo with the fit, looking racist as ever. The glasses are a nice touch with the American flag on his hat. And he turns around. The Blue Lives Matter flag, really big, printed on the back. Lila Menigo is definitely doing his job here in the suburbs of Canada. He is definitely a racist. And that's going to be hard to follow, but we have Benjamin Skinner. And right off the back, a blazing performance to start with the American flag across the shoulders on the shirt. I don't know if we've seen this before, ladies and gentlemen. With a bland rest of a fit, he knows what he's doing. Wait, the glasses. This man is racist. This man is racist. He's definitely in the lead at the moment. All we have left is Desmond Johnson. I'm not sure how he's going to follow that performance. Ladies and gentlemen, Benjamin Skinner has done something that many people cannot do. And Desmond Johnson comes out. He looks pretty basic. I'm not too sure why he would put on this fit. This makes his suburbs look not racist, and that's not a good look at all. He turns around, and we see he is, in fact, a racist. United we rise. Wow. That is Desmond Johnson. Always a twist. Always something to keep the crowd in awe. But I'm going to have to give it to Ben. Let's go in slow motion. So right off the back, we see Yo, Ben with the hat. Stupid, and man. you see that you already know he stupid. could be racist, but you're not completely sure. Your eyes scroll down just a little bit, and you see he has a cut off shirt on and you know he probably has a racist stylist helping him put these clothes together and that is what you need ladies and gentlemen to bring home the gold benjamin skinner has done it he has brought home the first gold in racist dressing man what the fuck is up nigga you know what i'm on and now in the suburb Olympics, we have men's acting like they're from the hood with Mark Phillips. He has been performing pretty well throughout these Olympics. Let's see what he has. Yeah, nigga, what's up, nigga? What's up, then? Pull up. Man, what's up, nigga? Swing, bro. Swing first, nigga. What's up? Man, this nigga too little for me. Get him, little Mark. And this is where he has to truly show us an Olympic performance. He's going to be the first Olympic athlete to perform in the Olympics. Man, this nigga too little for me. Get him, little Mark. And this is an Olympic performance. He has been put on the spot, something that nobody expected. Let's see how he handles this. Who the fuck you gonna stop, nigga? What's up, then? What's up? Yeah. Uh huh. What's up? What's up? Slap me there. Slap me. Slap me. Slap me, bitch. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's what I thought, nigga. That's what I thought, nigga. He's really selling this performance. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay then, nigga. Shit. You know what? Don't get. What's up? What? What's up? Don't get greedy. He has to close out. All right then, nigga. Y'all better head on somewhere, nigga. All right. Better head on somewhere. And he does. Good, nigga. They ain't even on shit. They ain't even on shit. They not know nothing. Yeah. And ladies and gentlemen, we truly have just witnessed a gold performance. Mark has done it again, truly outstanding. The way he pulled up his pants and got close to the ops really was a selling point for me. He could have been hit or even worse. And to come back at the end and confirm with Desmond like he really did something is truly the cherry on top. I'm telling you all, this is next level. It is. It is, John. He's definitely earned his gold medal today. Man, what the fuck is up, nigga? You know what I'm on. We have Jonathan Newton and men's acting like they're from the hood. Jonathan Newton could also be one of the sleepers. Let's see how this one plays out for the Poland Olympian. Yeah, nigga, what's up? Nigga, what's up? Swing first, nigga. Nigga, too little for me. Get this nigga little. What's up? What's up? What's up? And he came too close. He slapped, running full speed in the opposite direction. His bluff was called, and he's in the win. And next up, we have Olympic police calling. Our first contestant, Jonathan Newton, is getting ready to see how fast he can call the cops oh on some very, right there, very bro. innocent Almost black lost. people. And a big thank you to our volunteers. Y'all ain't know I'm finna drop 10 points. 10, bro, you got me. Yes, bro, because I can carry y'all every time, bro. Nothing. What? What's uh, up? No, I saw you back to the ball, but, I mean, we don't have to park here, so I'm just trying to figure out what's going on. What? There's a bro. court down the street, bro. Yeah, yeah, what you mean? We're walking to it. Oh, uh... I mean, well, Kirby's coming up, so y'all might as well just head back. I know you don't have cars and nothing. Kirby, so. what? You don't have cars? Ain't no fucking no, 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 Kirby. You gotta go on somewhere with that shit. Fuck it. Okay, well, that's fine. That's fine. I already called the cops, so it don't even matter what you're saying right now. Y'all might as well stay right there and don't even try nothing because this is recorded right here. Oh, oh, no, I'm just saying. Bro. Man, bro. I'm <laughs> staying nowhere, bro. It don't matter. I'm just saying the cops coming, so I mean. And a solid performance from the suburban man. He handled that really well. Called the cops before he came out, and I cannot be mad at him. I'm not sure if that can be easily topped. Everything he did, he hit directly on the nail. Amazing performance from Jonathan Newton. And a big thank you to our volunteers. Y'all boys already know what I'm finna do. What? Carry y'all. But you ain't never carry y'all. I'm not sure where our next contestant is. That's what I'm saying, for real. Oh, hold it, hold it, guys. Hold it. Hey, what's up? Just gonna report this guy to disturb the peace. What? No, we're not just going to... You may or may not have weapons on you? No, we have no weapons. What are you guys doing? What you guys doing? What's, What's going, going on? Oh, my God! Oh, my God! He didn't even come outside! A true Olympian, Dylan Patel, 
from the Indian suburbs has outdone himself in the 2022 Suburban Olympics. This may be the best gold medal performance we've seen this year. To still be so innovative after so many suburban people is honestly just genius. Ladies and gentlemen, we present to you Dylan Patel, and that ends our Suburban Olympics. Oh my God. Ron, I, I seen it. I seen it. Uh, truly amazing. Oh, I'm, I'm at a loss for words. Standing ovation. Standing ovation. Wow. Wow. And a one, a two, a one, two, three, four. The smack was laid down. Man, look here. When I tell y'all that when the dudes acting like from the hood got slapped, right there. I don't know how I made it through that. I was, I felt my, I felt it coming. I was like, I'm, I'm, I'm finna break. It's over with. I've been defeated. But somehow, some way, the great one was able to hold on and lay the smack down on the try not to laugh chop. Oh, that was tough. Oh, where did y'all break? I know you broke. I know some of y'all broke. I just need to know where a timestamp down below where you lost and why. If, and J-Rock means if, you were somehow able to make it through this challenge and not break, timestamp down below that's the smack was laid down. If you're not already subscribed to RDC World 1, go to the brothers, subscribe to them, and let them know that J-Rock, the YouTube people's champ, sent you their way, right? Post your comments down below. Let J Rock know what you thought of his reaction to this video. No rhyme intended on that line. If you enjoyed the great one's reaction, hit that like button, subscribe, and share. Make sure you hit that bell so you can be notified when it is time to be electrified. Thank you for joining J Rock. Stay tuned for my next video. Mamba, GG, and Wakanda forever. If you smell out, what J Rock? It's good.